Hey fam, it's Lamar, little, little Mama. This is going to be a preview for Earth Signs for the month of September. Virgo, Capricorn, Taurus. Happy birthday to the Virgos, it's your season. Now y'all know the deal, check your house placements and if this is not your story, it may not be for you. So this can actually go out until the 15th. So what are the messages for Earth Signs? Virgo, Capricorn, Taurus. What do they need to know and see? Okay, you got three. First one that came down is a barrel. Huh? You feel something is lacking in your life. Perhaps love, money, or goals. Hmm. Could be trying to overcome some obstacles. But what are you going to do to transmute this energy? Okay. Huh? I don't know if something's missing, but we got love. Okay. <laughs> Say something about spiritual love. All right, Earth says that's your business. Then we got chair filled. Someone new is entering in your life. Okay. So maybe something about out with the old and in with the new. And you releasing somebody. <laughs> and you moving forward. Huh. Cutting the deck. You have a hair font. And then we have the Knight of Cups. Ah. Water energy. And we have Earth here. Which is Taurus. Hmm. You know this is the God card, right? But it's like, I don't know if there's going to be some new commitments for you in the month of September. Remember, that's something about that love, right? And it could be an offer, but just be mindful. I don't know if you're going to be seeing somebody, you're dealing with somebody. I don't know if this person is drinking. Hmm. I don't know if somebody is dealing with two people. I mean, it could be masculine, masculine, feminine, feminine. Take whatever applies. You see these two masculines here, right? You see this feminine here. So I don't know if somebody uh, has a taste for both. That's what they hear. See? Mm. Uh, yeah. Got this Ace of Cups here. So something's correlating. Mm. New love, huh? Self-loving yourself. Something about a cup being overflow for you, right? Mm. At the bottom of the deck, get the Ace of Swords. The Spirit saying something's truth. And two Aces is something about a new partnership. Mm. So somebody new entering your life? I don't know. Because <laughs> now we got the moon here. <laughs> That's Cancer Pisces energy, right? So it's like for the month of September, Earth signs, right? I don't know if somebody's trying to call you in. Are you calling in a new soulmate? I don't know. But uh, something that you're feeling, it could be lacking in your life, right? But with love... <laughs> Something's coming in. Mm. Just have to embrace it. And someone new is entering your life. Mm. That's what they have seen. Mm. But at the bottom of the deck, we have this three of swords here, right? So like I said, this is in your past. So the heartbreak is no more. I don't know if you're dealing with an air sign, but something will no longer be lacking. That's what they said. Something about no more. Okay. But uh, we have this knight of swords here, right? A lot of air energy. So somebody's clearly going to communicate something to you. I don't know if somebody likes to go horseback riding, but there's going to be some kind of a swift action movement of what somebody wants to say to you. But see, you can't juggle. Remember with that Knight of uh, Cups, says somebody may like uh, both likings. Mm. But, they may say. but hmm. you may have overcame some obstacles, right? And whatever was adept to a situation, I don't know if you roll on the dice with something, right? But however, hmm. Something that you were either dreaming about since you were a child and uh, whatever you are planting with your roots. I'm hearing somebody is going back to basis. Mm. Yeah. It could be a new home. It could be a new job. It could be something, right? But it's something that you are feeling. Uh-huh. Now we got this privileged lady. Mm. Is it an offer? I don't know. But you definitely take care of yourself. And at the bottom of the deck, we have adjudication. So just be mindful, of course. And I did post something prior. So something about, in terms of the legalities, something about <laughs> either somebody is going away way. I don't know if it's somebody that you're writing in jail. It is what it is. I don't know if somebody's getting married in jail. Mm, damn, they said it's a shameless plug. <laughs> Y'all hear what's going on about who uh, got married. Mm -hmm. An artist, but I'm just saying. Mm. But... Something about a way way, right? And just be mindful of your health, okay? I don't know if you're going to be working too hard. Putting a lot of effort and time and efficiency into what you want, right? But if you need to go to your doctor, go to your doctor. 
Mm, and then at the bottom of the deck, we have this nurture. So I don't know if somebody wants to talk about a commitment. I don't know if somebody is um, celebrating a fall wedding or planning a fall wedding. If you are, congratulations. Mm, then we got this wealthy man here. Okay. So I was like, hmm, the wealthy man and a privileged lady. Is it somebody that's coming into some money? I don't know if somebody has uh, some type of inheritance. But however, you got somebody that wants to definitely uh, present something to you. Earth signs. Is it a new love? Mm. Is it a spiritual love? I don't know. But at the bottom of the deck, we have uh, sudden wealth. So don't worry about your money. Don't worry about your finances. Things are definitely going to change around. That's what they had said. But mind you, do you have to... Uh, Juggle the work and home life? I don't know. Mm. But just be mindful. Okay? You might be seeing a lot of things in September. And I don't know if it's a whirlwind or a change. I don't know if somebody's going to be saving somebody's life. I don't know if you're going to be seeing something in the news regarding this, right? But at the bottom deck, we have this letter here. So I don't know if somebody's going to send you a message. Mm. It says something about... An insurance policy. That's what I'm hearing. Mm. Just be mindful who's in your circle. Mm. You might see something. Yeah. And then, like I said, we have this doctor here. This is clarifying this. So, I don't know if somebody is worried about going to the doctor. Somebody needs to go to the doctor. Just to look at your health and your wellness, right? Because at the bottom of the deck, we have this false person, right? So, I don't know if there's somebody in your energy that is bad for your health. But it doesn't need to be mindful as they said right because now we got the lord here right so it's like i don't know if somebody's trying to control the situation i don't know if somebody's going to see something and it's to a point where maybe somebody's working too hard something about before you leave to go to work make sure certain appliances is turned off make sure the oven is not on something about somebody smoking falling asleep mm. that's what they had said for a few but with this wealthy man right I don't know if it's somebody that's your friend. <laughs> but Collective was like, listen, something about faithfulness, right? I don't know if it's a faithful friend that wants to say something to you. But uh, you're going to get some kind of a surprise. Mm. In the month of September, what's going to turn around for you? I don't know. Mm. Somebody's, uh, for the feminine, somebody's menstrual cycle could be off in the month of September. Getting a lot of downloads. We got this true gem here, right? And then we also have gossip. So I don't know if somebody's going to be talking about a situation. I don't know if somebody's upset because of the fact that you got this new love and this new offer that's coming in. But you're definitely not letting nobody know something. And I don't know if it's somebody from the exit that's coming back and they're trying to come back in and say something to you, right? I don't know if you're a blonde female. You could have right here. But somebody is definitely talking and they want to say something to you. Mm -hmm. So you want to come back out. Blind female. Mm. And something about children, too. Mm. Those kitties that are going back to school and even those that are going back to college. Something about a different transformation. Somebody could be switching up their their different um, subjects in terms of what they're planning to do when they go to school. If that makes sense. And see, we got the spiritual growth here. And I said something about the spiritual love. Right? Uh, earth signs. Mm -hmm. Or are you just embracing your spiritual growth? Getting a lot of downloads and some changes, right? Mm. I don't know if there's somebody in your energy that may have blue eyes. It could have brown eyes. And something about fair skin, right? But it could also be somebody that's dark skin. I don't know. They said something about, I don't know, somebody is hating on somebody because somebody is dark skin and somebody is light skin, vice versa. Mm, I don't know. But somebody shouldn't judge, right? Because we got bestie. Know your worth. You deserve better. So somebody is talking about something, right? Maybe release and let somebody go. Because remember that three of swords was at the bottom of the deck. And the heartbreak is definitely no more. I don't know if there was some kind of a trail. But you transmuting some shit and you switching it up. Mm. But just be mindful. Because we got somebody heh, that could be still thinking about you. But you know, I know when I always use this card, right? Ain't nobody fucking crying. Mm -hmm. Somebody could try to give you some kind of a sob story. I don't know if somebody wears glasses. But whoever it is, I don't know if you're dealing with somebody that was a narcissist and maybe you've seen something. I don't know if somebody changed their hair color. Mm. 
see something about that blue. Somebody could be speaking the truth and somebody could be telling some lies. Remember, at the bottom of the deck, we have this ace of swords, right? And something's about the truth, right? So just be mindful. Something about a social media hack. Somebody is changing up their passwords, right? And like I said, if you were, you know, in the month of September, if it's somebody that is new in your life, it could just be somebody with a different nationality, race, whatever you want to call it, right? But it's not somebody's business if you date outside your race, right? Mm -hmm, that's what he said. This is probably why somebody fucking talking. Collective is like, please, it is what it is, right? Mm -hmm. hmm. Somebody's always looking, right? I don't know if somebody's going to be talking in the month of September saying, hmm, this one's dating this one, this one's dating that one. But you're telling somebody to mind their motherfucking business. Mm. As you should, right? The collective. Hmm. Capricorns, Taurus, Virgo. Just be patient about something, right? Whatever it is that you want and what you need, you're going to definitely see those blessings. Do you not see all these pentacles? I mean, you guys are earth signs, you know? And I'm here, please don't fuck with the earth signs money because earth signs don't hear that shit. They is not trying to hear that shit. So at the bottom of that, whoever you may be dealing with, just think about certain things in terms of security, some kind of support. I don't know if somebody has a home-based business. I don't know if somebody is um, moving down in terms of either downgrading or making a transition from either working for somebody or deciding to work for your health, for, for yourself. Something about your health. Mm. That's what they had said. I don't know. Mm. Just be mindful. That's what they had said. Be mindful. Love. Mm. I don't know if somebody has to change up their social media account. I don't know if you could have any kind of platform. It could be Twitter. It could be Facebook. It could be IG. Should it be? be my fucking YouTube. <laughs> Just wanted to come out. Somebody's changing something up. But it's saying that you're ready. And somebody wants to take this action towards you. And if you don't want nobody back in the past, the collective was like, hell no. I heard signs. I'm just saying. Because why the bottom of deck? You let that shit go. Mm. You let that go and you said that you want this new, right? You want the new new. Somebody got to see for you. Someone new is entering in your life. That's what it has said. Mm. And when you release and let certain things go, if something is toxic in your energy, you'll realize the transition. You'll realize the difference. Whoever was bad for your health, you let it go. But we have positivity, faith, and optimism. I don't know if you've done all the Leo, but something about Leo energy. You open the doorway to positive experiences and opportunities with your positive expectations and energy. Do not allow negative energy or temporary setbacks to interfere your path that you are on. Keep the faith and keep going. What did I just say? Something about releasing certain things with low vibrational energy. Because you said you ain't got time. Mm. What else does Earth Signs need to know for September preview? Huh. See, I just told you. Gotta release that X. It's time has come to clear your energy. You cleared it. If somebody new at the bottom deck, I don't know if you're going in a honeymoon with somebody. Shoot, six of swords energy. Your ancestors are like, listen, it's time for you to go. Somebody's moving into the new now. Mm, mm, mm. Yeah. If somebody's trying to express their love to you, go ahead and make the romantic gesture. But like I said, just be mindful about deception and whoever's in your energy. Especially if somebody from the past, someone is wearing a false mask in this relationship. And this is why you let somebody go. You let that shit go. Uh -huh. And you told somebody you're moving forward. What else is Earth Sensing to know for the month of September? All right, we got this warrior spirit. Okay. You fight that battle. I'm just saying. Shoot. Strength, skills, discipline, and toughness. Your heroism, your stoicism, and self-sacrifice is conquering the ego. And if there was somebody in your past that had a big fucking ego, I'm hearing an earth sign had checked them. That's what they had said. I had earth sign. I'm just saying. Because mm. I don't know if you were dealing with somebody who was a clout chaser. I don't know. Mm. Somebody could have been jealous. And if you were dealing with somebody that was a karmic soulmate, <laughs> you were there to teach them some lessons. Mm-hmm. Because somebody was playing deceit and games. Uh, stop doing it. Someone may get hurt. Maybe you just say, don't play with your emotions. I don't know if you were dealing with somebody that had an SUV. 
or a car, but just be alert. Why? Because somebody was living in the fast way. They can't slow down. You telling somebody they need to slow the fuck down. That's why you let them go. Mm. But if there was somebody, either somebody from the past, somebody that's in your future, or somebody that you are currently dealing with, <laughs> what does Earth signs need to know? Ah, something within six months, okay? I don't know if you're dealing with somebody who's a cancer or a cusper. Something about summer. King of Wands energy. Ooh. Could it be Aries Leo Sag? Something about fast movements. And they want to move swift towards you. Something may pop off in the wintertime. And I don't know if you're a 70s baby. If you're born in the 70s, it is what it is. Mm. If you ain't born in the 70s, somebody said no. <laughs> That's what they said. I am uh, Virgo Capricorn Taurus. Mm, mm. But either way, they said that you're protected. And when you're quiet, you learn. When you step away, you grow. So that's what I have for you guys for the month of September, the preview. Please like, share, and subscribe to the videos. And I will check you on the flip side when you see these other videos come out for the month of September.